Gemini, welcome to your weekly reading. This is going to be for the sign of Gemini. It is not going to resonate with every single one of you out there. This is also not Sun, Moon, or Venus sign specific. Any placement you resonate with, the messages may also resonate with you. Personal reading information, any jewelry seen will all be linked and listed. We'll pull oracles at the end, give you a little bit more guidance for the week. Otherwise, Gemini, here we go. Your first card out is the Page of Wands. I do only take jumpers, so I appreciate your patience in advance. Sagittarius energy with this Page of Wands. Some sort of good news. There you are, Gemini, coming in strong. Major Arcana, Lover's card. And Major Arcana, the Justice card, Libra energy. So Libra season, by the end of Libra season, some sort of good news. You are either giving or receiving here. The Lovers is a choice, making a choice. There is a choice that's going to be made. It looks like it's definitely going to be in your favor. Some of you, it's a legal choice, some sort of legal matter, justice system, dealing with the courts. You will be getting good news. That's going to go real good. Everything's going to go as... Um, Everyone's going to get what they deserve. Let's just say that, okay? And it does look like you are more on the positive side with that page of wands. So, Also to just be deciding to do something exciting. Something new, something exciting is going to be coming into your life or into your energy that's going to help create balance. But it's a choice. It's based on some sort of choice, okay? Seven of wands, determination. Someone's determined. Mm-hmm. Some sort of boundaries could also be need to be set. Maybe because you chose to create some sort of boundaries. It's changing the energetic uh, karma field or whatever in your favor. Seven, I mean, nine of swords. Somebody's stressing. Mm -hmm. So instead of stressing, create some boundaries and, 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 and um, more Sag energy. Major Arcana, the Temperance card, Sag energy, Sag season is heavy. Heavy emphasis on Sagittarius season, which is November and the Ace of Pentacles. As I said, some of you are getting some sort of uh, payout from the court, some sort of legal matter you've been dealing with. You've been very, very frustrated by. It's been stressing the hell out of you. Stressing the hell out of you. But because you stood up and you determined and you had perseverance and you did not give up, you are going to get what it is you, de you deserve. You were very patient as well, too, with this temperance energy here. Both these uh, cars in your future energy are about balance, about um, making sure you get what's yours. You know, the justice is more of a karmic balance. You know what I'm saying? You might have been struggling, feeling like you had bad karma for a bit, but no, it's actually paying into your good karma. And because you kept your head leveled and you didn't, you know get 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 rude or feisty or, or or you know snaky you are going to get exactly what it is you're looking for some of you it's literally money it's an opportunity but at bottom of the deck is the knight of swords yeah force fierce determination very much a, a sort of determined vibe as much as this thing has stressed you out heavy emphasis on some sort of legal matter or you know some sort of court case for some of you and if it's not, it could be just a job or a pay raise. Because there is stress here. There is stress here. And for some of you, you're dealing with someone that maybe shuts you out that has been going through a lot. Maybe you're not aware of why they've been acting the way they've been acting. But it does seem like someone's been very stressed out and maybe causing them to sort of keep people away. And it looks like that's going to be coming to an end too. Once that balances out, you will be hearing from this person. You will be able to resume whatever sort of connection you have with this person. There will be a new opportunity. But it does look like someone is currently going through something. That you're either going to have to be patient with them for or you're going to have to be patient because it's pertaining to you. But it does say don't give up. Do not give up. It's like you're almost there. You're right on the tip. Heavy emphasis on side season. Which is after Scorpio season, yeah. So by the end of November, I believe. So, yeah, some of you, it's definitely work. Something to do with money. Some sort of, um, you know, compensation. Some of you, it's a family thing you got going on. And some, very much a fighting for your rights energy. Very much a fighting for your rights speaking up and saying what needs to be said not keeping a closed lip not keeping a tight lip not backing down 
that's what's going to get you what you what you're desiring what you're needing what you deserve it's stressful as hell though it is very stressful for whoever this is uh, resonating for whether it's you or someone else that's going through some shit because they're definitely going through something but with these major arcanas here this is huge this is like you cannot control you gotta let the universe just do their thing because the temperance is very much um divine intervention and you have two depictions with angels energy here so this is saying you couldn't even control this even if you wanted to it's very much the divine it's in their hands they got to move around the pieces and line things up and they're not quite lined up yet so, and you might not be seeing anything happen so you're stressed but this is saying do not back down don't keep um keep fighting there will be a new day there will be a new beginning you will be getting what it is you deserve it will be worth the fight because you are on the good side the upside of karma might not feel like that now. Might not feel like that now. Heavy emphasis on that. This is a love situation. Maybe you're dealing with someone that's going through some things, dealing with some sort of um, legal matter, and it's kind of creating a strain in your relationship. Even this is definitely what's going on. But this is saying it's only a matter of time. In time, things will balance back out. But right now, it's 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 a testing time. Calling in your soulmate, your prayers, affirmations, visualizations help bring you two together. And give a relationship a chance, work on your partnership. Yeah, very en heavy emphasis on patience. Could be dealing with a Libra, a Sag, another Gemini, heavy emphasis on Sag. Maybe the person that you're dealing with is very, you know, kind of distant right now and you're not understanding why. But this is saying, this is why they're stressed out. They're going through some things. They're going through some things, but there's a there's a tunnel. There's there's a tunnel. There's a light at the end of the tunnel. The page of Pentacles is very much light at the end of the tunnel. You are gonna get what it is you're desiring. Very very um divine energy here. Like it's like divine orchestration. That's what it is. Divine orchestration. It's like everything needs to fall down in order for the pieces to fall in place, right? So you may not understand it now why things are going the way they are, but there's there's a really positive outcome to the chaos don't let the stress um get to you we have here you're very close to achieving your goal see i can't make it up i mean i could but i i'm not conclusions are within reach full moon eclipse and we are in eclipse season so heavy emphasis on soon very very soon we just entered eclipse season you're very close to achieving your goal and conclusions are within reach so i mean yeah Especially if this is some sort of legal matter that you're dealing with. It, it I know. But it will it will all pay off. It's it's out of your hands right now. It's like you know, let go and let God with all this angel energy. The great gathering, it's all coming together. Intuitive hits and soul tribe. And break the chain. Ancestral pattern, healing, rewriting the future. Yeah. See, I was getting that coming out of the cave energy. I swear I just said that. Light at the end of the tunnel. Mm -hmm. let's see what this has for you Gemini guidance for Gemini please oops that's way too many ask yourself if it will matter in 10 years if it will not if it won't don't sweat it so this is saying don't stress more emphasis on do not stress do not let the outside circumstances create any sort of reality for you because it's not what it seems things are happening things are moving guidance for gemini please prayers affirmations visualizations so this is saying keep the faith keep the faith and elephant spirit learn from the past number 25 which is a seven so you have two sevens here jackpot energy fortune energy abundant energy and something about not forgetting. So if you were wronged in any way, this is saying you got to fight for that. You got to fight for that. Bad spirit, a rebirth is assured. Okay, that is your reading, Gemini. Hopefully it resonates with you. Thumbs me up. Don't forget to subscribe. I will see you guys next week.